What's up deckers, welcome to another Steam Deck news video. In today's video, Lossless Galen is on sale. Steam Winter Sale is happening right now. We have a new Steam Deck client update. We have a look at what the Steam Machine intro might look like. It's a new Steam Deck OLED competitor. We have some Humble Bundle deals. And finally, it looks like Valve is stopping production for the Steam Deck LCD model. So if that's something you guys were interested in, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Let's get right into today's video. So first in news, an incredible app that we have covered a lot lately is lossless scaling and this app is on sale on the steam store you can get this one for 489 and that is 30 percent off if you're looking for a way to get frame generation to get more fps out of your game definitely check out this app and we've done a lot of video to showcase this so again take a look at those videos see how to use this would highly recommend it, especially for this price next in the news steam is having their winter sale and you can get a lot of incredible games for a really good discount right now you can get games like hollow knight silk song that just released for 20 percent off for 16 dollars you can get games like red dead redemption 2 for 20 dollars and again we are going to have a dedicated video going up here pretty soon to give you guys our best deal so far so if you were interested make sure you stick around for that next on news we have a new steam deck client update and we're just going to break down what comes with this update so to start in general select and sleep in power menu will not prompt the user to enter display of downloads when appropriate and with this it does bring some fixes like our list here on the bluetooth send screen we will now detect and notify the player when trying to pair and connect an xbox controller with older firmware versions that cannot properly connect to the steam deck with accessibility move the screen reader stop talking button to x so that the external game pass can still open the quick access menu for friends in chat suspicious or harassing group chat message can be reported directly in the chat window by selecting the message and pressing options we also have some fixes to remote play the biggest improvement with this update comes for steam input and again i'm not going to go through everything here but i'll just list it here the biggest thing i'll have to say with steam input is if you use gyro this is a really good update they did make some improvement brought some fixes and made some changes so again if you use gyro definitely check out this new update there's a lot going on here for it well if you were curious about what the steam machine boot up menu might look like it looks like brad lynch is at it again with some of these leaks and in this video you can get a sense of what that might look like as far as if this is going to be what the final version of the boot up menu for the steam machine is going to look like i can tell you that 100 percent this was just leaked by him so we'll definitely be keeping an eye out for this but i do think the boot up menu looks pretty cool let us know in the comments below what are your thoughts about it next in news it looks like we are going to have a new steam deck OLED competitor with the Lenovo Legion Go 2. It looks like SES Lenovo might announce a SteamOS version of the Legion Go 2 but in my concern no because I feel like the price of this is going to be absolutely ridiculous. As you guys know the Legion Go right now if you want to buy it is almost $1400. I feel like an advantage that the Steam Deck OLED has over this is just pricing. But yeah let us know what you thought about this. Are you guys excited about seeing a new Steam Deck OLED competitor with the Legion Go 2. So next in news, Humble Bundles having a better with a friend co-op adventure bundle and with this you can get some really cool co-op games like trine 4 and others so again i'll post this here i do have to say this one is time sensitive because i do believe this is the last day that you can get this bundle so if you are interested definitely make sure you hurry and pick this one up so next in news it looks like valve is ending production with the steam deck lcd and it seems like once the stock is gone they're no longer gonna stock it so if you guys were interested in picking up a steam deck lcd you better hurry and pick it up it looks like valve is only going to carry the steam deck oled going forward which makes me believe that we might see a steam deck 2 announcement sooner than we thought or it might mean with production parts increasing it's hard to continue to produce the steam deck lcd but just want to share this news with you guys again if you guys were interested in getting this one you better hurry up and do so all right fellas that's all the news that we have for you guys let us know which news stands out to you guys appreciate you we'll catch you in the next one until next time Peace out.